now down to the final match of the day here on Compound Saturday. Stage one of the 2016 Hyundai Archery World Cup Tour. And it is Demir El Achma of Turkey taking on Mike Schlosser of the Netherlands. Good look at Demir El Achma. He's done so well recently. He's come up from nowhere. Put on a great show in Mexico City last year. We'll talk more about that in just a little while. He had a tough road this week to reach this gold medal match. Beat Dejan Sitar by two. Took a tiebreaker from Alex Wiffler by shooting an X in the shootoff. In the quarterfinals match, it went to a shootoff again where his X was better than the other guy's X. Dobby's, Dobby Budens. And then he got past Peter Elzinga by three. And what does he get? You, you get, get a chance other. to face Mike Schlosser. <laughs> Come on Mr. down. Mr. Perfect. Yes. The world record holder. That was incredible watching him get his world record this week. It was an amazing week for Schlosser. The one point went over Abhishek Verma. He was three better than Gabriel Badenforst of South Africa. Five up on Brosnan in the semis, but you were talking about his performance in that qualification. Shot an unbelievable. 717 out of a possible score of 720. Yeah. And he used two different bows. Yeah. <laughs> Did he just hate that? <laughs> and his, his second bow what over the second half, he was perfect with that. He got he got a a three. Uh, he, he only dropped one point in the first in the first hole, three dozen. And then he got a 58 in one end for the second three dozen. And, and when that's happening, the word is spreading throughout the field. Everyone People, was there. everybody knows this. That there's almost a murmur that goes through it's the crowd. Crazy. We're all just waiting. Fifteen. So Mike Schlosser from the Netherlands starts off. It was great watching him as well. You know, he came off the line and he just had just a just a little deep breath. Just a. Mm -hmm. That was it. No nerves. Very little seems to phase him, which is probably part of his success. Yeah, of course. But then this guy got a 150. Oh, Demir El Achla is an outstanding in, archer. In the semi-finals, go against. Oh. This is the one concern that Ron Vonderhoff has for Mike Schlosser when he gets to the final matches. He's a little bit nervous. A little bit nervous and puts a little bit more pressure on himself. Right. He's so outstanding. Yeah. You know, to be perfect in qualification and then. Right. He needs to learn how to treat this just like any other just match. Just like qualification. Right, like qualification. There you go. So can Demir get a perfect 30? Yes. Yes, he does. Demir El Achla from Turkey, the 2015 gold medalist at the World Cup Finals in Mexico City. And Really, his run last year started here in Shanghai, where he finished fifth, picked up 13 points. He really didn't do, I mean, he was just consistent along the way last year, Lucy. Yeah. By the way, Lucy O'Sullivan from GBR joining Carl Arkey here on World Archery TV. We hope you're enjoying our coverage, shot-by-shot -shot coverage, but finished fifth in Shanghai last year. He was sixth in Antalya, eighth in Wrocław, 17th in Medellin. Okay. So I don't think people really saw it coming yeah. so much. Yeah, he was just sort of just there, but not quite there. Yeah, he was there. No, not on the podium. But he got to the podium, and it actually was his first trip to a World Cup Finals last year wow. in Mexico City. And his first trip was a good one. Yeah. Yep. And I believe it was the first. Kid done good. Yeah, I think it was the first uh, World Cup Final gold medal for Turkey. Yeah. If my memory serves me correct. Oh, there's a bit of a shake there. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. So, uh, so Mikey kind of, well, it wasn't really a twitch. It was just a little, a little shake, and obviously just offset the the, the front arm and just this shook the arrow into the angle. El Machla, very steady, steady as she goes. Be interesting to watch. Um, Mikey's release again. Mm. Same problem. Do you hear the whole crowd just went, ooh? Mm -hmm. It's like the air went mm. out of the crowd. I didn't expect this. And when I was talking with Ron between sessions, well, this is a little bit of what he was worried about. Right. 
I somehow get a feeling that you know, this feel won't upset him too much. That no. he'll probably be back and win. Oh, I would think so. Win some more stuff. And he's won, and, and the thing about it is he gets okay. to, to gold medal matches. Oh, what happened there? Well, um, see if he's seconds? got time 11. to get it done. Ooh. Ten. Seven seconds. Ooh. Fish. He may not get it off. He's not oh, going to get three, it off. I don't think two, so. One. Can he get? No, he cannot get it off. He just missed. He cannot get it off, and we have seen this before. Oh my God. I'm literally holding my head in my hands. Have you been there before and had that happen? No. no. I've never had to come down twice. I've, I mean, I've had. Uh, I think in. What was it, Armenia, when we got our silver medal in Europe? I had a fletching came off, so I had to sort of take the, the arrow out, put a new one in. So, yeah, that, that shakes you. But, but that was you know, you still get a nine or a ten or something, but twice. That was shocking. If you kind of come down once, you got to come up the next time. So, despite the struggles that Mike Schlosser has had, with the two eight, three eights, he has a four point lead. It's still up for grabs. Exciting. Or excruciating if you're Demir Elma Achla. And everything was going so well for Demir Elma Achla. His first five arrows, all X's or 10's. Then on the sixth attempt, could not get the shot released. Now he's able to pull himself together and salvage a nine on the first shot of the third end. Meanwhile, Mike Schlosser with a new lease on life. I think it's just safe, isn't it? See, I, I think I spoke too soon. I, I thought well, we talked. We talked earlier where you said you never know what's you going to happen. You never know. I need to keep telling myself this. I remember never seeing know. something similar to that with uh, Marcella Tonioli in yeah. Tokyo in 2012 at the World Cup Finals. Okay. She went out very Thank early. Yeah. Almost the same situation. Yeah. It happens. It's crazy. How could he not pull back his bow twice? Do you think it was the poundage? Or? We'll have to find out later. Oh, what a shame. But then you never know, Mikey. Five, could get us. No. Okay. Then. Does it look that way? <laughs> Three straight tens. Yeah, he was not happy with that shot, though. And his lead is still at four. Four even with a miss. Let me update my scoreboard here. So yes, that miss has certainly turned this match around. It's been an interesting week here, to say the very least. Yeah. Men's competition, Sebastian Peno, Rio Wild, Dominique Genet, Stefan Hansen all went out early. In fact, Stefan Hansen missed a shot early in his match when his release went off too soon. Here, Demir Elma Achla tried twice to draw back and release his arrow and could not, could not do it. Yeah. Oh, no! What are you doing? Pull back. There you go. Oh, okay. So his arrow is coming off of his rest. So mm -hmm. he's coming down yeah, to put to reload his arrow. Whereas I've seen oh. many compound archers do this. So there's, if that happens, they'll just flick it over mm -hmm. with their finger First rather than come down. Five, ten. So obviously, uh, oh, Mike, it's a bit shaky there. Yeah. You called it. Sell the flag yeah. How's it all right? You can kind of tell with Mike if it's going to be a good or a bad shot. Okay, so. Right, so he's flicking his arrow on. There you go. Focus, six, seven, eight, so that brings uh, Elma Anchala back within four. Awesome. Yeah. The nine, though, not what he was looking for. So he tries to close that gap and tries to overcome that miss on his sixth arrow. Oh, twitch. There you go, nine. So he's, he's, he's helping him out a little bit, but 
It has not been a clean match for either of these archers I, here in the I gold medal match. I expected 150s. And it looked like uh, Il Machla might have been on his way towards that. Yeah. He got derailed on that sixth arrow. And, it, and it's having the mental game to come back from it. That is a huge shot for Mike Schlosser. It goes up by five now, 111 to 106. Yeah, uh, Interesting thing about Mike Schlosser is he's won a world championship. Yeah. Did it in 2013 in Belek in Turkey. But there have been other times where he's gotten to this point in gold medal matches and, just come second. and come second and just has not been able to get over that hurdle. It appears as though he will today due to extenuating yeah, circumstances. Exactly. Yeah, that's the thing. In normal circumstances, that wouldn't have... Probably would not have happened. But to get perfect, perfect well, with a miss and then drop two shots each time. So, Demir Alma Achla can only shake his head about that 20, score of 20 in the second end. Just an example of how far, though, you can come. Two years ago, when he came to Shanghai, he was ranked 407th in the world. He's now 7th in the world. Uh, made it to the gold medal match, where unfortunately, was not able to release his sixth arrow. And again, oh. having more problems. I can't watch. Tell me when it's over. It's almost over. Oh. No, he's flinching again. He is still struggling. It's five. Three seconds. Let it go. Okay, pretty good. Five. Pretty good. Oh. Result, oh. all things considered. Oh, dear. <laughs> You know, some days you just get out of the wrong side of the bed. Yeah. That's all. Yeah. There you go. I'm going to be fascinated to hear what he has to say yeah. to worldarchery.org after this match is over. It'll be on it's the website. It's going to be a nice read. It'll be an interesting read. And there it is. It is over, and Mike Schlosser wins. In one of the strangest matches we <laughs> saw it all day today. I couldn't watch all of all of the no, arrows. No. <laughs> you were having a tough time there. I was so, nervous for both arches. I think we were all having a tough time. You you always want to see everybody do the best they yeah. possibly can. But congratulations to Mike Schlosser. Especially as both archers in their semifinals got 150 points out of 150 points. And then in this match, not so much. Not so much the 150 points I was expecting. No, it was not what we were expecting. In fact, the final score is 139 to 135. Had a really interesting match nonetheless. Ah, the bottle opener. There it is, the bottle opener, right next to the, the bigger building on the right. That is the Shanghai Tower, second tallest building in the world.